Hi everyone, this is Goddess Lily. I am finally finished with this U-Part wig. And um, this is what she looks like. So I'm kind of playing with the camera. So that top's all ventilated. So you can see a little bit of the track. I mean, you can't see the track, but if I move the ventilation away, you can see the track. So all of my U-Part wigs come with ventilation around the U and right along the side right at that little part Let me play with the light a little bit and then there is a machine sewn track that starts and goes around to there and the reason I had to stop the ventilation here is because let me show you the cap this is the cap that it's made on this is um U part wig center cap. There's ribbon that stops right here. And then I'm sorry, this is this is lace. So I can ventilate through this lace right here. But this is ribbon. I cannot ventilate through that ribbon. So I also want to show you tell you how I modified this cap. And I'm going to show you the inside of this wig. So if you look real closely. You know, this cap has these straps. Actually, it's inside out. So, um, okay, so these straps. In order to make a wig that you can wear in a high ponytail, I have to remove these straps and I have to remove this flap. And I have to sew a track in the inside so that way when you wear it in a high ponytail, all this would be covered. So what I do is alter this wig. So since I'm going to remove these straps and this flap to sew elastic, I'm also going to alter this. So what I did was I took this flap off and I moved it into the inside. So let me go ahead and show you the inside of this wig so you can see what I'm talking about. So I offer a really, really super good price for this wig. So this is a U-Part wig. So when you go to my website, wigweeds.com, click on the tab that says U-Part wigs. Okay, so this is the inside. As you can see, there is a track in the inside. So that is where you, it would cover when you wear it in a high ponytail. So let me move this track and you can see the elastic. Okay. So there's elastic sewn in, as you can see. There's that elastic band. So I totally, totally took everything off the back of that cap, sewed elastic, and put that track in the inside so that it, this wig can be worn in a high ponytail. It is all machine sewn, and then we have the ventilation around the U. So we have little tiny clamps here, and the bigger clamps around the edge back there. So, I don't know real closely if you can see the flap. Now you see how it's just all flushed, all even, all the way around? This is the flap. I moved, it was sticking, it was coming out like that. So I took it off and moved it in. I could have t 
totally took it off but um, I like that little stiffness there so here's that flap I took that flap took the seam out and just moved it over to uh, so now it's coming all the way around like that so that way you get an even smooth curve around the ear so let's see this hair is just so beautiful and the company that she bought the hair from is called uh, Virgin Rumi Hair and there's the website. She sent me um, 18, 16, and 14. And this is the price. This is what she sent me. 18, 16, and 14. And that's the price. So 12 ounces of hair. And she has a little bit of um, 16 and quite a bit of, um, oh no, I'm sorry, she sent me, I think she sent me 18, 16, 14. She sent me um, 20, 18, and 16. Can you see that? Yeah. Okay, so for $216, well, 204, $12 for shipping and handling. And um, so $216, I think that's pretty good. The average is like $89 a piece for the hair or maybe less. Okay, so um, there you have it. How you know that this is a custom made U part wig by Goddess Lily is because all my wigs have that ventilation across the top. So it lays totally flat. You know, you won't have that little track to show up there. Okay, so um, put your orders in, guys. <laughs> I'm looking forward to hearing from you. And also, I just want to mention that I am taking a hiatus from making closures. Some of you have, um, you know, contacted me about closures, and I said that I'm no longer doing closures because I wanted to focus on uh, wigs and I love making this it took me probably two to three days to put the actual wig together and another uh, two days to three days to do the ventilating and um, so I say in all in all five to seven days so this wig's going out to the client today and uh, that's all so thank you for watching <laughs>